here today um i think it's just after 11 o'clock i just want to go cut the boys hair um as to my hair i guess sure like i'm not too sure what i want to do with my hair but i don't know my sister suggested to me that maybe rather grow it and then ohono it's like the cut stylish short haircut so i'm thinking i'm considering that so for now i'll just leave it as um as it is and then i'll decide once i get the length that i want to start considering the cut so yeah let me do that for the kids and then yeah there's just a few odd things that i need to buy for school because schools are closing next week so i just want to buy um a few things just for the last week of school i guess sure we'll see how today turns out so i just thought i should start a new vlog welcome you and yeah, let's see how it works out bye for now um just in case you were interested to see what i'm wearing i'm wearing this red dress and um a pair of tackies i'm not a sneaker girly but um <laughs> I do have a pair of All Stars, um, but I washed them. And then luckily I had another pair of sneakers. So I'm wearing sneakers because I'm, I feel like I'm gonna be doing a lot of running around today. So hence the sneakers, but I'm very comfortable. So yeah, in case if you're interested in what I'm wearing, let me show you. I'm wearing this dress. Let me just try and um, push you down a bit. So I'm wearing this red dress. I love it so much and I'm wearing these sneakers, <laughs> yeah, there we go, wearing these sneakers and my favorite ring. Anyway, let me get going, I'll see you when I see you. I would like to get to know. A Sunday the 24th of September a friend of mine called me up and said let's go to a wedding <laughs> you know so I thought why not um, just um, to give you a bit of context I've been a homebody for the longest time I've been an antisocial person for a long time so I thought this would be also a nice opportunity just to go out and mingle and get out of my comfort zone my mommy comfort zone so I'm really looking forward to it so yeah let's go and I'm sure we'll enjoy let me see you on another day and bye for now see you soon My teeth are not as strong as they used to be. Um, yep. Morning. Today is the following day. Um, yesterday, um, I last spoke to you yesterday when I was going to the wedding after party slash group. And one thing about yesterday, honestly speaking, I highly recommend it every once in a while. You know, because, um, and I'm speaking from my experience, I feel like as a mother, I tend to forget that I also matter, you know, my fun time also matters, you know, because I'm so caught up in providing for the kids, making sure that the kids are happy, making sure that the kids are having fun, making sure that the kids are protected. You know, so yesterday it felt good to just breathe a sigh of relief. Yes, I know it was at Groove, but felt good 
you know it felt good and tell me why at our table at this wedding um it was mostly ladies there was wipes uh pampers wipes there was a sanitizer and a what did I say or a, a hand lotion and not even the lotion mind you the tub and I'm like hey you know you can take the mom out of the house or out of that environment but you can never take them the mom within the person out you know so yeah it felt good to mingle with other ladies and one thing I have to say like the ladies we presented yesterday the ones who came the right way but linger invitation like they looked amazing you know the girlies looked so on fleek their hair in stalls this were beat to the gods the gents looked dapper and proper you know um yeah no they, they, everybody looked amazing yesterday you know and i love that that they respected the theme but yeah no, everybody looked good yesterday and yeah just to emphasize on that as well or you know it's okay to take some time out that's what i realized yesterday you know um when my friend was here to to fetch me i remember one of my sons asking me Jorge, um so who's gonna take care of us who's gonna put us into bed you know who's gonna look after us while you're gone you know um at first i felt a bit guilty and the first response that i wanted to give my friend was no you know but then again another part of me was like yes you know let me just go and see what's happening and the nice thing was that like it wasn't too far from where i stay so you know, and it was a beautiful setup by the way you were beautiful i think there was like three marquee tents deco was beautiful impeccable there was an open bar at some point like there was a man lying on the floor the way i think we all know we dying but anyway um I will keep on emphasizing her take that break take that break and who suffer a little while and it doesn't make you a bad mom for going out to groove like i said for us it was a wedding but it's one of those it's a wedding slash reception slash after party just like you have after tears this was like an after party of the wedding the groom and the bride were having a time they were having the time of their lives so yeah so i, I i'm 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 happy for how things turned out yesterday and all I want to say is you matter as a mom your fun also matters just as much as your kids fun matters and let loose and enjoy the ride morning today is Monday yo I really really played myself this weather is horrible oh but you know what I feel like as human beings, we don't know what we want because how chaser we complain, how bad that we complain. But one thing I know about myself personally, I hate being cold. Hopefully, I'll chat to you soon. I'm Cost 19 Rand 91. Our Brent crude oil is at $92.85 a barrel. 11 to 21. Mombella 14 to 24. Uruguay 14 to 20. I'm so heartbroken. Um, I just heard the news of the passing of Zoleka Mandela and oh, I'm shattered because just last week there's a chance of her healing something to that effect you know and to hear this today you know guys what breaks my heart is that you know and I don't know if any other parent can relate with me but you know one of my everyday prayers is you know lord keep me until my children can fend for themselves you know because already you see and then now for your children to go through life without you you know it's such a privilege to have kids and it's such a privilege to raise them and to watch them grow condolences to to the family you know and to her children you know my heart just bleeds for the children it's happy I, I know that she had a little one recently I think a year or two years ago I stand to be corrected but no yeah Lord have mercy and about you know because there's really nothing much you can say to someone 
always eating anybody until you go through that pain, you know, and especially pain a pain a mother or a father respectively. You know, so yeah. One of my many struggles as a mother to boys is this. There's the loo and I've, my boys are getting to a point where now they want to use the loo by themselves and they want to use specifically the men's bathroom. So I'm trying to talk quickly so that nobody comes out. And I was suggesting to my son that he goes inside this one because at least this one is one and I can stand by the door. I can stand by the door for this one, but now he insisted on going into the big men's toilet. The one really doesn't want to go to the girls' toilet, which I understand. You know, so if you are a boy mom, any suggestions? Obviously, I know at some point they're gonna have to start going to the men's toilet by themselves. Welcome to another day. Um, I'm thinking the last day of this vlog, today's Friday. The time now is um, just after two o'clock. I want to head home and um, drop off. Sorry, I got distracted. I want to go home, drop off, um, take out the things from the car because I want to take the car to the car wash. It's quite um, filthy, to say the least. Okay, not that filthy. Like, there's just odd crumbs here and there and um, pieces of grass. So, yeah, let me get going. Let me do that. And just by the way, I, I don't like car washes. I honestly don't like car washes. It's never been my thing. I think that's why for the, my car would always be dirty for the longest time. And Ratabua, as soon as... Um, Maybe as soon as I get to the car wash, let me just focus on the road. Okay guys, sharp ne? Bye. Hey guys, um, I'm by the car wash now. And it's actually quite hot outside it. Um, this morning it was quite cold um, yeah uh, you know what I'm gonna close off <clears throat> um, at the car wash I decided otherwise I decided to just come straight to the car wash instead of going home because I'm thinking once I'm home I'm not gonna wanna get out of the house anymore so I just thought let me come straight to the car wash do what I need to do then head home and then I'll call it a day Oh, I'm so hot. Um. Anyway, I wanted to say if you've made it this far, thank you so much for for watching. And um, please do like the video. Please do like the video. Um. Hope please do subscribe if you did make it this far. Sorry. Please do um. Consider subscribing, I guess, or please do subscribe to the channel. Um, thank you so much for your time. Let me see you next week by God's grace.